Yeah, but at the same time, I look at my personal experience within a multitude of Black cultures, and I have never really fit in from uh, that community, whichever community's point of view. I've always been the kind of guy that's like, oh. And if you look at most creators in the arts, they don't fully function within any given community at all, especially comedians like Todd. I mean, it's, it's <laughs> just... Oh. So from an industry point of view, from a, a profit point of view, if you're a broadcaster or a studio, diversity is going to kill your bottom line. Diversity of story is going to kill your bottom line from that point of view. Right, like how many, from that point of view, absolutely, yes. absolutely. So the idea that a film like Moonlight would cross over as big as it did was anathema to that mindset, yeah. right? Or but the Black I, Panther, or Black Panther. Right. That yeah. was still largely within a framework that they, like it didn't, the only thing that really challenged them was the blackness of the story. The, the mm -hmm. genre, the genre yeah. was, okay, we can wrap our head around that. But films like Moonlight and uh, what's his name? The, the Keenan Peels or whatever their names were. Yeah, Keenan Peel. uh, Get Out. Get, Get out. out, yes. Right, yes. fundamentally shook up the industry to the point where I think it's just confusing a lot of people at the top. It's like, and it's making them more insecure as far as their positions are concerned. There's been a bloodletting of executives throughout the industry.